in phase shift keying the phase of the carrier wave which is analog is switched as per the input digital signal this is analogous to pm that is phase modulation which is a kind of analog phase modulation the concept is same as before in phase modulation analog phase modulation the phase of the carrier wave is varied according to the instantaneous value of the message signal modulating signal okay so in this case also since it is just a digital kind of uh, modulation the sequence the input signal is of digital nature and the carrier wave is varied or switched according to this input digital signal so let's understand the concept with the help of this uh, beautiful waveform so here we have this digital input signal 011001 and this is the carrier wave analog in nature digital in nature and now we want to perform the phase shift keying so how to do this since we will vary the phase of this carrier wave here according to this digital input signal so how to do it watch carefully so whenever there is a, a change in the input signal that is here it is changing from 0 to 1 and here there is no change and at this place there is a change from 1 to 0 and here it is no change and here it has changed from 0 to 1 so whenever there is a change from 0 to 1 or 1 to 0 a phase shift of pi that is 180 degrees takes place in phase modulation in PSK so let's understand it how it takes place at since here it is zero so there is no change in the wave and this carrier wave is transmitted okay and at this place it has been changed from zero to one so phase shift has taken place here this place you can see here it's a uh, its shape was in this direction it is was it was going down but it has started from upwards and a phase shift this is a phase shift of pi okay so at this at this place there is no change from 1 to 1 so it, it there is no phase shift at this place okay since there is no change okay continuous uh, analog uh, carrier wave is uh, transmitted at this place but there is a phase change from 1 to 0 okay there is a phase change when it is a change from 1 to 0 so you can see it here okay phase change has taken place of pi and uh, now there is no phase change from 0 to 0 okay so it is continuous at this place carrier wave is continuous continuously transmitted and at this place there is a phase shift okay so you can see this phase shift of pi here so this phase shift takes place only when there is a transition from there is a change from 0 to 1 or 1 to 0 so keep this in mind if there is no change in the input uh, uh, signal it is not changing the bit then continuous sinusoidal carrier wave will be transmitted so this was all about digital modulation techniques yes okay hope you got the point if you have any doubt you can ask in the comment section of this video hope you liked it in the next video we will see more concepts of modulation and other topics